So I have a little confession to make. I was a little bit hesitant about shooting this video because in it, I'm gonna be very transparent with you about my six sources of income, both active and passive. So with that said, cross our fingers, let's go. Joining us is my man, All right, so I've broken this down based on something that I learned from one of my early mentors, which is that wealth is really about having active income streams and passive income streams. Active income streams is the money that we're actively working for every day, passive being you know, how we invest our active income in order to create real long-term wealth passively. So this is basically broken down based on that. And so let's go ahead and get started with the active income streams. Now, these aren't necessarily ranked any in any particular order. However, you know, full stack is my primary business or full stack marketer, more specifically. Specifically. So there we service really two types of customers and this is a courses and coaching business. Our first type of customer is the aspirational entrepreneur. Somebody that has the goal or dream of becoming an entrepreneur but they have no idea where to start. And there we teach them uh, what I call freelance marketing or which is more, more commonly called affiliate marketing. And that's basically how I earned my first million dollars and I still earn millions of dollars per year from that strategy. And so that's what we teach primarily in, under full stack. We're also rolling out a new product line that is more focused on existing digital entrepreneurs, so people that are growing their existing business using digital marketing strategies, and we're rolling out a product line to help service them as well, where we share some of the tactics and strategies that we've used to now do almost $90 million in sales. And so this business right here, as we're about to round out the year, should land at about $20 million in revenue for the year. Now, I've nested this next income stream right below full stack because it's very closely related, and that is affiliate offers. So I still promote multiple affiliate affiliate offers. I literally do what it is that I'm teaching people how to do. And I've created a pretty significant a recurring monthly income stream uh, from that as well. So there we're currently doing about $300,000 per month and growing. And what's nice about that is even if full stack were to go away, I still have this additional $300,000 a month, most of which would probably continue to recur for quite some time. So this is on top of full stacks, regular day to day sales. Up next, I have Inspirion. Inspirion is a business that I launched uh, just this year. Uh, it's really a legacy play for me. So really taking a slow growth approach to this business. If you've seen any of my YouTube videos or watched some of my reels on Instagram, you've probably seen me talk a lot more lately about, you know, really focusing on slow, consistent, methodical growth that protects both the, the customer experience and protects the longevity of the business, longevity and health. So this business is pretty slow growth, but hey, you know, for its first year, we've done about 500 thousand dollars in revenue there. My next income stream is one that I'm partnered in. I have equity in this business. This is Zero Chase Media. And what Zero Chase Media does is it's a traffic business. And really what it is, is we found with our full stack clients that a lot of them had a really hard time getting their business up and running when they had to learn how to do Facebook ads or YouTube ads. It's a pretty, you know, big hill to climb, big barrier to entry. And so what I did is I, I partnered with a buddy of mine who's phenomenal at what I call email traffic. He goes out, he finds publishers, people of giant email lists that are chock full of the perfect target market for our full stack clients. Uh, he goes out, he brokers that deal. Uh, he takes care of all of the logistics. All our full stack clients have to do is sign up for one of his packages. He takes care of all the rest and they just start to see traffic start to flow in to their business without them having to learn a ton of difficult strategies. Of course, we want them to graduate to some of those more advanced traffic strategies, but you know this helps them start to see results fairly quickly without a ton of additional learning and work. So there we do about an additional $200,000 a month, a little over that right now. My next business is Experts Agency. This is the agency in which I'm a minority shareholder in this business. I actually partnered with somebody that used to be a quote unquote mentee of mine. He used to work for me. He became a customer of mine in that process. Over time, he learned a lot about online advertising, got better at it than even I was, and eventually wanted to leave and start his own business. So I decided to partner with him. In that business, we focus on Facebook, ads, YouTube ads, and we are venturing into some other advertising channels. And we basically run the ads and manage ads for other entrepreneurs. They were mostly focused on just exclusively course creators, coaches, experts, consultants. So businesses that are in the info space, we service them exclusively. Currently, like I said, with Facebook or YouTube ads, and we're branching into some other uh, ad channels. So there we do about $250,000 a month right now, creeping up on $300,000 a month, 
kind of nipping at the heels of it at the moment. The business is almost three years old now. So it took a pretty slow growth approach to that one as well. You add all these together, it's gonna to come out to about $28 million for the year, which is roughly my gross income. Now, in order to you know help you understand though, this of course is not all profit. These businesses vary in terms of their profit margin from you know on the low side, as little as 20% up to about 40%. So it varies quite a bit depending on the different business models. But $28 million is you know top line revenue and income from my various active income streams. Which brings me over to the passive income streams. So for me, I went out and found myself a family office. I don't want to spend a bunch of my time thinking about how to invest my money for passive income. That's not my zone of genius. I want to stay inside my zone of genius, which is here in marketing, sales, growing a business. These are the things that I'm really, really good at, as you can see here from these numbers. And I don't have time to then also become some sort of an expert at how to invest money for long-term wealth. So I went out and found a family office, which acts as a fiduciary. What I mean by that is that they are not incentivized to sell me any sort of investment opportunity. They make no commissions selling me anything. That that way they are only incentivized to keep me as a client and the only way that they can keep me as a client is by helping me see returns on the money that I'm investing. That way they have a, a an interest, our interests are perfectly aligned. When people are working with a broker or something like that, where they get a, a paid a commission based on what they sell, well then you have a conflict of interest because what they're incentivized to do and what you are incentivized to do are in conflict. Here, there's a much more happy marriage over the long run. So I work with a family office, they invest my money, and so far we've broken that down into you know, various strategies. We have life insurance in there, I have stocks in there, I have some real estate funds that we're investing in, some hard money lending funds that I'm investing in, and even some cannabis funds that I'm investing in. The goal here is to kind of spread it out and diversify some of the investment to begin to see about an eight to 12% annual rate of return. Now, I'm not necessarily focused on highly speculative investments. I like to be fairly conservative. Warren Buffett said, number one rule of money, don't lose it. And highly speculative investments are the way that most people end up losing tons of money. That's the amygdala acting up in our brain, wanting all of the pleasure without the pain, wanting to get rich quick versus just you know getting rich slow and effectively over time and minimizing the amount of risk. That's why the old adage of the tortoise and the hare, and we all know, who won that race. So I'm more focused on some fairly conservative strategies. These are all businesses, everything that I'm investing in is businesses that have been around a long time, they have a long track record, they can show their consistent returns for their investors, and my family office is great about vetting them out for me before they bring those opportunities to the table. So I wouldn't necessarily consider this income because I don't take any money off the table here. I take all my money here and I put, pile as much of it over there as I possibly can to build long-term wealth. Our focus here is getting to eight figures a year of passive income through uh, these various strategies. So while it's not necessarily income today, it is income in the future for potentially, you know, quote unquote retirement. Not that I ever really think that I'll ever retire because I just absolutely love working and love doing what I do. So, uh, but it does add more options for my long-term wealth. So listen, I hope you got some value out of this video, which is really just me helping to demystify all of my income streams and where my earnings come from. Now, if you're somebody who is driven, ambitious, motivated, and serious about success in life and business, then make sure that you subscribe, hit that little bell notification so you get notified every week when I drop more content like this. And by the way, in case we've never met before, my name is Kiala Kanai. I'm an entrepreneur that got started while working in a coffee shop for minimum wage, and I've gone on now to create multiple seven and eight figure businesses, just like I say at the end of all of my videos. And I say that and share that so that you know that everything that I'm sharing on my channel comes from the real world knowledge of things I've learned and applied in order to create those results, which I share here in hopes that they help you create similar results as well. So subscribe, hit that little bell notification, and make sure you watch that next video in the lineup where I'm going to share more business success secrets. I look forward to seeing you there.